Yo, what is up guys? It is Ripper and here with a new video for you guys today and guys we got a spicy one let me tell you. Alright, so Activision, we gotta have a talk here. We understand you want to update your game, right? Yeah, we get it, huh? Uh huh? Can we explain, maybe, can we get an explanation why your idea of a new weapon ha just has to be the most broken idea you could have ever thought of? Right, right, we're like, you know, we're gonna bring a pistol to the game. Right, it's gonna go psych off. But brainstorm, easy. We're gonna make it fully auto, right? Like, no one's gonna use, bro, man, we're gonna release this gun, no one's gonna use it. It's gonna be a dead gun. Man, we don't have to worry about it, bro. Just add all the damage in the world, add the most OP fire rate you can. Guys, we're about about, dude, we're straight about nuke for dawns. Who cares, bro? Let's just break the game. They ain't gonna use it. Yo, opposite happened. Uh, Warzone is officially taken over by this gun, as you guys can see on the screen. This is the build, by the way, of the most broken meta. It, it's better than the FFAR. Give you an idea, the FFAR, like, time range, is about a 400 millisecond. This gun's time range is a 200 millisecond. 200. There's a 200 difference compared to the FFAR to give you statistics for this. Meaning that you'll beat out an AMAX, FFAR, single Diametti, uh, MAC-10, Cold War MP5. You'll beat out every gun with this gun. Now you think, oh, what could be so broken? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> you see this drum mag on the bottom? 80 rounds right but then you're like oh it can't get even worse right oh, i promise it can a kimbo but then oh it can't get even any worse oh but trust me i promise because of a kimbo you now get 80 rounds each gun top smg ammo is about 150 i think it is tell me why you're getting 160 rounds of smg in a pistol right and you're like Wait, what? You're like, what makes it auto? This fucking attachment. Last barrel, the Sorokin 140 millimeter auto plus full auto. <laughs> oh, to make it even better, plus fire rate added onto that full auto option. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> so if you want the build to try it out, here's the build. You got mono suppressor, Sarkin 140 millimeter auto barrel with the 80 round fucking drum mag and an akimbo that is the build that i am running this currently is like the top meta that is taking over warzone as you guys see the stats below this is what we're running i mean your accuracy is lowered obviously your mobility control obviously but that doesn't matter right because you want your damage your range and your fire rate to be the most broken thing that's possible and as long as you hit your shots which i'm going to show you the recoil as well in this video as long as you can control the recoil hit your shots you are literally never losing a gunfight with this so have fun so ladies and gentlemen welcome to the dual uh, welcome to the akimbo broken meta of call of duty welcome to the new age i'm going to show you the recoil so you guys an idea this is no control at all by the way i'm gonna i'm gonna shoot and no control it so you can shoot double single i'm gonna shoot both at the same time so you can kind of get the idea when you go it's basically a direct up maybe at a little bit of an angle again this is up close now we're gonna back up just a little bit and we're gonna go far back here now Again, it's a straight up control, meaning that with this gun, if you logically can control your aim, you basically can run this gun down to the ground. And now I'm controlling it bottom to where I'm just keeping it centered right here, meaning that if somebody is in any generation just sitting in front of me, they're going to get lasered, right? And same thing here, if I'm aimed here, and I control it down mid, and I'm holding down mid, it's basically going to hold this center point at all times, making it where you're never gonna miss. And this is also sucks for a lot of people because this means you're gonna deal with, you know, say you have a full squad of Warzone, you just, you have them in front of you. Every person in front that's inside this laser POV is dead. Like, that just shouldn't be allowed. 
that that damage level that I just did with this gun is just shouldn't be allowed in this game. And another example before we kind of hop over to Warzone and show you and kind of help you understand why this is such a big issue for me is the fact that you could basically run into a game with this gun and just out throw any MP5 player put in front of you with this single akimbo gun and I just don't think that's okay for the Call of Duty scene right now like in any way or form like the fact that this gun is still even fucking in this game I'm mind boggled but if you can center your shots down to the point where you can keep it mid any team that enters that doorway is going to get obliterated right and again that, that's a pretty far example but normal scene would be here you're sitting here you see them you're holding that center shot forcing them to sit right inside the fucking shots it's like gg rip see you next game all right boys round two ladies and gentlemen we are running it we have stuns i'm gonna try to show you what this gun can fully do when it's fully put to test and you guys can uh, judge it for your own if that makes sense and let me know your thoughts do you agree with this gun being this good or do you think that this gun just shouldn't be this good at all like hmm that guy just didn't last chance oh there it is i can hear the pistols from the start look at this ladies and gentlemen guys just look at this ready i had one armor this is one armor plate what was that a second a second right maybe maybe a second that, that's not full armor that's one armor plate full health that was under guaranteed a second that he found a way to down me i can already see this being ultimately just mind-boggling fucked i'm here for a mission i will kill anyone in my path especially the guy that I like to go fucking far ass distance to fucking laser me like get the fuck out of here well that's totally normal damage i am being lasered guys please just let me land one time that is all i'm asking why am i not able to land hello Oh, almost did it to him. Oh, I was only single firing that one. Rip, my bad. All right, entering back into Superstore. Guys, I can't just, bro, they, this this game just won't let me land. People are holding me like, like I'm their parent right now. Like, I don't understand what I did. But like, these people are like holding me like I'm their fucking parents right now, bro. Hello. Did I just down him and like, how fast was that actually what teammate be test p test on me thank you behind you see i shouldn't be able to do that to somebody like 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 i have to be honest the fact that i can kill two people in probably under a two three second period just shouldn't be allowed in this game that's all i'm saying but on that note guys uh that was a lot of fun um obviously you guys can see the guns are very much broken i mean you can literally squad wipe i mean not just not just you know duos like like i did but like four men four men in one in just one running you don't have to reload you don't have to even take a break if you hit your shots perfectly they are all dead and under probably 30 seconds all four you always down all four and this is an issue this is going to ruin a lot of warzone and you know whether you like it or not this is warzone this is the state of it i mean there's you know we have a week till verdansk basically gets yeeted and uh we'll see what happens right let's end warzone right let's end verdansk the right way by fucking breaking the game even more great job activision uh Go fuck yourself.